If you use two-factor authentication, which is a must these days, you should be using it with one of the many 2FA applications on the market, such as Authy or the Google Authenticator. Unfortunately, not every service works with 2FA Authenticator applications. Shame on you, services. Although the app take on 2FA is much more secure than that SMS flavor, at this moment in time, it's inevitable that you'll wind up getting some of those 2FA codes sent to you via text. When that happens, you have to retrieve those codes from the SMS message and either type or copy-paste the digits into the service making the request. Or you could make use of a feature introduced in Android 9 called SMS Verification Code Autofill. Let me show you how to enable this feature. To enable SMS Verification Autofill, you must first enable Autofill. To do that, open your Settings app and search for Autofill. In the Autofill service window, tap to enable the service you want to use for Autofill. Next, go back to Settings and then navigate to Google Verification Code Autofill. Tap the on-off slider until it's in the on position. Once this is enabled, any app that supports the autofill option will include an autofill button in the SMS notification. All you have to do is tap that button and the six-digit code will automatically populate in the app so you can log in via 2FA. This isn't a perfect setup, and not a lot of apps are making use of the feature. But once more services and applications catch on, it'll make using 2FA incredibly easy. I would be remiss, however, if I didn't remind you that using two-factor authentication with an authenticator app is the safer route. So if you have the option, always use the app over SMS verification codes. Hey, everybody. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel. And be sure to check out more how-to videos at how to make tech work.